Hello everyone, welcome back to another Lumion Legacy episode. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is episode 10 or 9. Um, and last episode we made that data store where if you already have a game, then you press the continue button. So yeah, so today I'm gonna actually make the encounter grass, you know, and stuff so that can work. So yeah, let's just get into it. So, you just to, uh, okay, just so this is easier for you guys, so like, if you guys want to add more encounters, you guys can do it by just duplicating it. So, make a folder in workspace, name it Grass Encounters, and then make a part. Um, this is gonna be my grass. You can have it like better, or make it look better and stuff. But um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do like this, and if they move around in here, then you encounter Lumion, right? So. Put that part in grass encounter and make it can collide off i think if you want um and anchor true and then you can name it encounter i guess um and um yeah that's that so we can even do this <clears throat> and yeah so um yeah, so if you guys, I'm gonna show you that this works with all of them. So if you wanna just add another one, it's right here. Um, I'll just put it here. Okay, so we have two encounters. Name it the same. I mean, it doesn't really have to be the same, but yeah, I'll just keep it the same, I guess. So um, for the doors, okay, we, we made a script in here. So just to make it or keep it organized, we'll put a script in the folder too. So, grass encounter handler. It's basically gonna be the same thing as the door handler. So, let's make our local touch. Okay. So, and then we're gonna maybe need an event. Eh, probably not. We'll see. Yeah, probably not. Um. Okay. So, and we're gonna be fixing some stuff. So. Um, so for um, comma um, grass encounters in pairs script dot parent dot parent dot grass let's do this get children okay so um, and then if grass encounters is a Base part and um um the name is equals equals to encounter because we don't want it to do anything else so only the encounter parts just like just in case you have something else in um the folder by accident um okay so now we'll do grass encounters dot touch connect function and then hit um. Okay, and let's get players like this. Okay, so we're gonna do touched is equal is equal to true now, and also here we could do and touched is equal is equal to false then. So, and then and now we're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna do this lo ra local random encounter is your math that ran this is not like we're gonna make like a chance thingy for the actual like encounter lumion or whatever your thing's called but this is like for like the walking around you, you'll see and we're gonna, we're gonna do um one comma five and then if it's like one then because it takes some time for the encounters so it'll be random i guess so yeah um then and then you know when we made or let's go into client scripts and then it should be here take this um wait take all of this because wait for now just take this okay and then put it here um and then this player we're not gonna need anymore we're gonna change it okay so we'll, we'll just need the color so this GUI module, we're gonna make a variable for that. So 
local geomodule module is going to require Yinga service modules. Whoops, infrastructure geo module. So yeah, now we have to go into the or actually now get all of this. Okay, and we're gonna put in the module script. So let's open the module. And don't, you don't need the player anymore, so let's just move that. And I'm gonna need some to change some stuff. So, okay, the exclamation mark right here. So let's get the player. There we go. Um, we could move this, like, but. I guess it's already here, but I don't, I don't know. You know what? Yeah, let's move it into the... Let's make a whole nother GUI for this. So, in counter GUI, uh, put that encounter exclamation mark in there. Um, and then we'll put it to encounter GUI. Um, so we don't need this is equal to well actually no is equal to player dot player gui wait for child encounter gui wait for child there we go um do we clone it no i don't think so okay so now we made the field of view thing okay so that's wayne camera the field of view and then the tween size um i forgot when we're supposed to make it the transition um okay wait i think it's supposed to be right here and then we do this no wait one Oh yeah, and we're gonna need something else. Tr transition frame is equal to player. Player GY, wait for child. Transition, wait for child. And there we go. So this is gonna be transition frame. Transition frame. Uh, okay. There we go. So now we can print. Yeah, I guess, I don't know. And then we're gonna disable this client script for now, just so we can test it out. So I'll press play here. Oh god, why is it taking so long to load? Alright, so, um, I'm gonna just go here. Just keep walking over it. Okay, this is taking too long, so we might need to make the numbers, like, one to three or this just doesn't work so what we're gonna do to make sure it works is print works i guess and we're gonna do one comma three. Oh, whoops well it's random so and we didn't make touched false so right here wait one touched is equal to false so that's our, like our little debounce so go again so it might happen right away okay so it worked as you can see but um index nil with player gui okay let's see but um yeah i'm gonna put this back to five because i was a bit too quick let me save this real quick what the, what did i just do um Hold up, guys. Oh my god, I'm sorry, guys. That took so long to fix. That's a restart studio and everything. Alright, so where, where were we? Oh, whoops. Those are the doors. Uh, going to grass. Okay. So I'm pretty sure it was working, but we got that one error. So let me go back to the... C oh, wait, no. So this. We got the error here. <clears throat> Let's see. So, player. Play it up. Okay, let's see. Alright, sorry guys. I don't think you can get player here. So, player. So, we are gonna need the player. 
um, if hit the parent, find first child, um, humanoid, and hit the parent is a model, model, then just to make sure whatever is touching it is a, you know, player, um, and then we could do hit, and boom, I think, I think that's good. Um, player dot player okay I think that's good let's test it out again play here <clears throat> okay some output we go here hmm player you is not a valid member of part oh oh my god my bag alright guys I think I know how to fix this so uh, we could get player here by just doing players get player from character hit the parent. Um, yeah. So, and then just to make sure if player, then and then we paste all of this and then we could just do player. So let's press play here, and this should finally work. Hopefully. works okay we probably didn't get one yet hmm it's kind of weird how it's only printing it once oh never mind oh hmm um what the okay this is super messed up <clears throat> okay, um, we're gonna do this, and then I wanna see what this does, cause that was very weird, we might need to wait a bit though, oh, okay, okay, tween out, maybe um okay so it's not tweening out as you can see um and the camera also didn't tween for some reason okay hmm let me save it doing that kind of weird <laughs> alright guys up here if player and touched is touched is equal to equal to false then hmm Okay, let's, let's test this out again. I don't know why I was doing that. Okay, okay, nice. So it only printed once. Let's try and do this here. Okay, good, it's working. And then we wait 10 seconds because I made it like that. Um, because I'm trying to see if it's just something wrong with that. And as you can see, we're not getting anything just because of the cooldown. Okay, yeah, this is getting kind of annoying. I'm just gonna make this three. <clears throat> okay, we still haven't gotten anything. Oh, okay. It printed ye, but, oh, okay. Oh my god, I missed it. Okay. But as you can see, it still doesn't work. Hmm. <clears throat> Alright, that's. Alright, so I'm also gonna move. Oh, whoops. Uh, let's close this also. Okay, we're gonna move this here. Just so, like. Um. It encounters first. And then. 
Yeah, let's see if this works now. <coughs> let's hope this works. Okay. So I just keep going here. Hmm. Oh. It's because touch is true, so. Let's make that. Let's just do that real quick because okay I don't know why it's only doing it twice and I am just not getting it this is very weird oh I finally got it okay okay between now um all right this is getting annoying okay <clears throat> all right so we're gonna do here print ye and then we're gonna make it true and then yeah um i don't know uh, okay also this takes too long so we're just gonna make that three one out of three and i don't know why this transition frame is not really twinning back because it makes no sense um Somehow this is twinning, but this is not. Wait, let me um transition. Yeah, that's just weird. I don't know. Oh, let's test it again. Okay, so go here. We get one. And tweens, okay. Alright. Yeah, um, Okay, so it, the camera is not even twinning, which is bad. So camera dot field. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna wait to and then do this. I just want to see what that does really quickly. We need to fix this. I don't know why you have to like switch in between parts. Okay. All right. So that seems to work. It's just the camera is not. Oh wait, 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 wait. Let's go back. Um, we're gonna do task about wait here. All right, and then let's test this out really quickly. Just want to see if that fixes it. Okay, nice, nice, and no, that didn't. Mm. Okay, I'm just gonna remove this. I'm gonna do something else. All right, so task. Oh uh, wait, one. Alright, so instead of this tween, I'm gonna do local tween. Oh, whoops. Why is it there? Let's go to tween service, create camera. Uh, whoops. Tween info. Oh my god. Um, I have no clue what I made it, but I'm gonna do this property table and then field of view is equal to. or 20, sorry. And then we just play it. So let's see if it works. Okay. Okay, our camera is just not tweening in. Okay, but it, that works. It's just our camera, which is kind of fine, I guess. But I would like the field of view to change because it looks better. But we're gonna keep it like that for now because yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need to change some stuff. Wait, encounter. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it like that for now because this video is getting long and I'm just doing nothing. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.